I had a client that was missing a field and act and wondered how to get that field back. Well, I just want to address that with you a little bit. First of all, act comes pre-installed with a number of fields or layouts already in it. So if you come up to the top and click on this drop down, you'll see a whole series of layouts. Now I have more than what you'd see because I've worked on this for my training to add some things. But if you first come up here and check out some of the different layouts, you might find that the field you're looking for, if it's a standard field like phone number or email address, is most likely somewhere in ACT, in one of the layouts. So if you need it really quickly and just on occasion, you can find it that way. However, if you want to add a field to ACT, there's a few things you have to do to accomplish that. The first question you have to ask yourself, is this a unique field? Is it something that's already pre-installed in ACT? And if it's not pre-installed, the first thing you have to do is come up and click on Tools, and then you've got to come down and click on Define Fields and create that field. Now, I'm not going to show you how to do this in that tutorial, but I just want to note that that's how you do it. That's a starting point. So let's say you want to put a field in ACT for the name of your contact's pet. You know, is it a dog, is it a cat, but the name of the pet. Well, you'd go in, you'd create a field called name of pet. And then the second step is once you've created the field, you have to install it in the ACT layout. So you'd click on design layouts, modify the layout in question, click on contact, and you'll go in and add it with that tool to add it in to the layout. So this is a little bit of oversimplification on how to do that. And I'm not really addressing some of the other things you need to consider, but that's just a simple overview of what you need to do. If you're an ACT subscriber to their subscription plans, this is something that technical support can help you with. Or if you really need assistance with this, there is some thought you want to put into how you do this and maybe the kinds of fields you put in. And I always recommend working with a certified consultant, of which I'm one. So you can always reach out to me. My name is Tony Hollowitz, and I just want to give you this quick tip on working with adding a field to an ACK layout. Thank you very much. Have a great day.